We are here at Tianjin in what they call the Italian Concession. So most of the buildings here are like, well, buildings from Italy. I don't know what Mickey Mouse is doing there. <laughs> Connect the dots. So let's have a slow walk and see what we can see here. Uh, you shouldn't come here with uh, an empty stomach because food is very expensive. It's actually a tourist trap. You just go here to take pictures or videos and then afterwards you leave. Lots of restos. Look at the price. 32 RMB, 26 for milk tea. It's freaking expensive. Man. That's a hotel, that one. Lots of pictorials going on in here. Usually for weddings. This is the map. It's actually a very small area, just a few blocks. And then the river is over there, I think. So there are those pillar thingies with sculptures on them. And yeah, I think it's a church. Makes me want to go to Italy actually. <laughs> I want the real thing. All those fields, there's always Starbucks. Fountain. <laughs> Nuovo Cinema Paradiso. Those are souvenirs over there. Don't know how much. And then there's this. Centro per gli scambi culturali in Italian. So if you're interested in culture, Italian culture, maybe this is the place to go. on the other side of the road. So as you can see, Tianjin has a lot of buildings like this. You know, if Shanghai had a French concession, Tianjin has like French, Belgian, Russian, Italian, you know, name it, they got it. So, lots to see. them to be found, I mean, like that bridge, that building, lots of them, everywhere. Uh, up, up. Uh, so this is the river, and then there's this bridge. Still walking. That's the version of a tuk tuk. One of the popular tourist attractions in Tianjin are public toilets. No, I'm joking. Of course not. You just really need to know where you know the public toilets are. But I'm walking around here. It seems like in you know, the same buildings because of the many European concessions before there are many leftover buildings here different designs you can have British American no I don't think there's American uh, British Italian Spanish Belgian other than that well, mostly that there's a lovely small church here dwarfed by skyscrapers and then there are those buildings over there are they Russian I don't know I'm not familiar with architecture. And you have that building and that. So yeah, it's an eclectic mix of everything.
So that's basically the routine. You know, you start walking over there, cross the bridge, walk again over there, and then cross the bridge, and then walk again over there and cross the bridge. I'm looking for that Tianzi and I. I saw it earlier, but I can't find it anywhere, anywhere here. Maybe it's on the other side. Maybe. So it's quite normal to see pictorials like that. Because the city itself is so picturesque. And, uh, oh, lots of charm and old style glamour that you could capture. Weird. That's the Tianjin Eye over there. Getting close. And this is it. End of our Tianjin walking tour. That's Tianjin Eye. If you ride it, it's the only ferris wheel on top of a bridge, I think, in the world. Yeah, Tianjin.